Boston's new police commissioner is in office now and looking to deliver on some big promises to the community. Commissioner Michael Cox was sworn in this morning. WBZ's Courtney Cole visited the neighborhood where Cox grew up and found neighbors are expecting him to follow through. I, Michael Cox, do solemnly swear. On Monday morning on the Circle of City Hall Plaza, Boston got its new police commissioner. He is full of love for this community. And I'm proud that today a boy from Roxbury is going to serve as the commissioner for the Boston Police Department, first and finest in the country. To come to a place where I grew up, where I was raised, where I was an officer, where I raised my family, this is an incredible opportunity. One that Commissioner Michael Cox knows comes with great responsibility. And uh, I uh, look forward to making sure I live up to that responsibility. When asked how his experience in 1995 is going to impact who he will be as a city's top cop, he said... You have to be cognizant of the worst part of this job, and I am. Right? I, there's no sugarcoating around it. I know um, if things go unchecked, we can do bad things. And so because of that, we're going to intentionally make sure and remind people that these things can happen so that they don't happen. Cox says he has a lot on his priority list. We have to talk to officers. We have to go back out in the community and hear what they have to say. But is still working on the game plan, promising transparency in the process. With an emphasis placed on helping the department look like the communities it serves, we went back to his community of Roxbury to get reaction from residents. For me, as someone who grew up in this area, lived in this area, I think it goes even beyond making sure our police officers represent our communities and come from our communities and really um, have the tools. It's going to be equal. He'll break it down through the system. That's what he's going to bring. Commissioner Cox knows he has a pretty big job ahead of him, but he says he needs your help doing it. Now he's calling on everyone who truly has love for Boston to be a part of the process and to give them feedback along the way. In Roxbury, I'm Courtney Cole for WBZ News.